It's the day before the wedding, and Emma's about to see the dress that Patrick has picked for her for the first time. Her groom knows exactly what's at stake. Today is the day when uh, Emma either says, I'm getting married or I'm not. It all depends on the dress. Emma's mum has finally come round and is there to support her daughter. But will the dress Patrick has chosen measure up to Emma's Cinderella number? I'm actually shaking. Right, Emma, are you ready for me to show you the dress? Yeah. Or will it be her worst nightmare? Oh, that's hideous. It's like an old granny dress. Is that my size? It looks way too big. <laughs> Bought a size 14. I'm a size 8. They do come up really small. That's... So we'll try it in, try it on, That's and awesome. see. Right. It's not going to fit. I can't believe you bought a size 14. Em, don't worry about yeah, that. Yeah. That'll all be sorted, be but it's... it won't. But will she like it on? There we go, Emma. Oh, oh. It's gorgeous. Oh, oh I love it. It's, it's, it's so beautiful. It is. Oh, that looks lovely. Dude, that's better. Oh, my God. It's so nice. So, I just love it. Yeah, it, it actually it. suits me. Can you do alterations in that short amount of time? Yeah, but there is going to be a charge for taking that in, OK? okay. Hi, Patrick. Um, listen, Pat, uh, the, the dress has got to be altered and it's going to be £60, so that's fine. Patrick's agreed to pay for the alterations without daring to ask for a discount. I love it. I think Patrick's got it spot on. I think mm. it's beautiful. And it's not what I'd have chosen. I love it so much. And he has avoided the princess dress. Maybe it's a good thing because looking at this dress to what I was trying on, the, the other one seems a bit tacky and a bit Jordan-like. So I'm actually so glad that he stood well away of that. It's taken three weeks and cost £12,000, but the day Emma has waited ten years for has finally arrived. Oh, I'm feeling so excited now. I just want to put my dress on. Patrick has organised a special delivery for his bride. Oh, my God, she's got me... <laughs> <laughs> what has he got you? Hold up. You made pants. Oh. Do you think I'm... <laughs> what size oh. are they? They're, They're my size. Yeah, really nice. She's clearly overwhelmed by her underwear. Will the brown bridesmaids' dresses impress her as much? Oh, my gosh. Didn't expect brown. As I said, I hate earthy colours. <laughs> but look how beautiful it is. I love oh. them. You look so pretty, all of you. It's the final countdown, and a buttonhole's getting the better of Patrick. I mean, Matt, how the hell are you meant to do this without two pins? Three, two, one, hoorah! 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 <laughs> You're getting married, man. The time has arrived for Emma to show her family the dress Patrick picked for her. Oh dear, now is not the time for a wardrobe malfunction. <laughs> so I can feel my well, hairpiece is falling out. It Your won't necklaces. fall out, I tell you now, because it's got clips all round it. Do this. Well, it already looks crap, my hair. Emma. 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 It looks amazing. No, Emma. this bit looks rubbish. Touch me. Chill out. I'm yeah. a boy, don't listen to girls. Oh, Emma looks amazing. Don't get stressed. It's fine. It's not 
falling. Oh, I don't want to wear that anyway. You have to. I don't have to. <laughs> this is just going to ruin everything. That'll stay in if you just... Well, well, as soon as someone touches me, it's going to fall out, and I don't want anyone to touch me. That looks fine. Talk about the bride's villa.